everybody, welcome back to another episode of Funky Steve's Medinas. So today we've uh, moved systems with the Gary system here right now. And let's have a look in the star map where that is. So we're in Clan Ghost Bear territory, well, Outward, Outwards Alliance Ghost Bear, uh, right here at the Water World, which is good, um, especially if we're going to be facing the clans. Um, we've got all our mech mechs back from repair. I took the uh, medium lance pilots out in some of the lower mechs here and picked up a little bit more sea bills so we'd had en have enough for our financial statement and enough for the move to the new system. So we need a million sea bills now a month, which, you know, it's pretty much doable with two lances going at once. Um, got no tasks going on, 10 days to the financial report. So let's have a look at the contracts here. And we're going to run our main lance first. And I want to do um, this surveillance outpost mission. It is a... Um, Two and a half skull against the clans here, against Clan Ghost Bear. Um, it's a capture base, so I'm hoping that this one works out relatively well. Um, and then for later on, we've got there's a few missions back here for our medium lance to take, uh, or our secondary lance to take. Uh, looks like there's a Flashpoint Clan Scout, which we're not going to do. Okay, not at five skulls, anyway. Uh, so let's take this mission today. And we're going to go full salvage. Um, not worried about the financial report, our second lance can make that up, no problem. Going to accept the mission here. And we'll flush out these guys. And bring in our main lance. So, Steve, and we need Hellcat, and we need a Rhino. And in this particular mission, I'm going to bring in Saint, I think. Um... I think having the Warlord ability is going to be more helpful. So the Mjolnir is going to be in first. Um, we're going to leave Rhino in the Victor. Uh, I haven't decided yet. Um, do we go with the Nodachi? Not sure. Um, the Orion's the other possibility. I think maybe Saint and the Orion, probably. Um, and if we want to capture parts and stuff, I'm thinking maybe we go with the overheater Jager mech. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's run this. Three skull against uh, two and a half. Should be fine, I think. So let's deploy this and get it done. Alright, so there's something fishy definitely going on at this... this uh, facility up here. We're going to go find out what it is. Um, not relying on the fact that there might be turrets at the start. Got a feeling it's a Lance of Max most likely. And I don't see any turrets here. So I think we'll be turretless. Ordered. Definitely want to engage the Lance of Max and kill them quickly. I'm liking the speed on the Orion, it's nice. I think we're gonna lose some of that though when we retool. Yes, Commander. I don't know, you know, it's still no dashies. I don't know, we gotta figure out what we're doing with that thing. It's either gonna be this Mjolnir or the uh the Victor as the melee mechs. One of the two. Come on. You know, the other thing too is we can make the Nodachi command of the second lance. Although normally I usually have... Oh, good. This guy's right on top of us. We can kill him fast. Janet 35. Grinner. Sure, man. Seems pretty happy to be over there. Mm hmm. That's what I do. Oh shit, it's one of those LMG ones. That guy's gotta die fast. Um. I'm not going to move in too fast. What's this guy? Piranha. Okay, fire on this guy. Okay, there's a start. Good to go. 
sink can move up quicker. Aye, aye. Okay, we got eyes on. Even better. And firing. Okay, hit with one. Steve should do a little better job, I think. Oh, yeah. Um, not going to Warlord yet. And firing. Okay, Rhino. It's up to you. Let's see if we can remove this guy. He's unstable. And firing. Okay, we hit. Nice. Is he going down? Oh, he's destroyed. Nice. Enemy down. That guy's a headshot master. We gotta make sure he's gone. I don't care about the rest of these guys. Pran is next. Another Grinner. Yeah, targeting the sky firing. Let's make them think twice about using hot overheating weapons. Alright, any weapons that provide heat? Oh, head hit, nice. Waiting for orders. I try and position myself so that I'm not gonna get hit by uh in the back by anything. Um yeah, man. Aye, aye. Zero? We got no hit, no flamer hits? With like 85%? Really? Flank attack. Eh, yeah, firing. Yes, Commander. Roger. See if we can finish him up. And yeah, firing. Another head hit, nice. Uh huh. Reporting minimal damage. Thanks for coming out, buddy. I'm receiving you. Location confirmed. Yeah, firing. Target down. Okay, I'm interested to see what the second lance is going to be for this. Grinner. Bunch of lasers. Don't know if they're like smalls or what they are. Full speed. No target. Now oh, we got a target right here. Target confirmed. Okay, one hit. Got to cool off and dump everything into this guy. Wow. Four hits. It's going down. I think we took his leg off. At least it feels like we did. Uh, no point staying up there. Move back here. And fire two, CT. Here they come. Reporting critical hit. That was a CT hit. It's almost gone. If 
Back in the fight, eh? Good job, buddy. Don't let that Greener come to us. We're not going up to after him. And firing. Ready for orders. This guy ain't grinning anymore. Uh, just gonna go with these. And fire. Yeah, we didn't need much on him. Tango down. Uh, let's reserve. Okay, pulse lasers. Yeah. Let's give him the what for, Steve. Yeah, here it comes. Ooh, only one hit, eh? Enemy critical damage detected, Commander. Moving out. Have to quit the CT though. Stand on your barbecued friend here. Sorry, buddy. And fire. Copy that. Objective complete. You're clear to move on. Nice. Sorry guys, I'm playing this result really reserved. I just have no idea what to expect from the clans. That definitely was not uh, any threat. Steve, full speed. Get up on the hill. That thunderbolt. Standing by. Go claim that base for us, will you? Thank you. We've got all long range weapons. There's no point in us moving order. down to engage them. Because they're coming down that valley there, most likely. Any any reinforcements. Yes, Commander. So we don't have to move too far off this hill. All right, we're in good position. Receiving you. Um, Got it. Hmm. Commander. Try and get as far as we can here. Here they come. Spectre, Arbiter. <sighs> I was hoping for something more. A two and a half skull? I guess maybe not two and a half skulls. A couple of light lances, I guess. Still thought there'd be more. Tons of hesitation minus here. They better have more than two guys. We don't we can't even get eyes on from over here. Okay, two more though. A Bessie. Two Bessie. Really? This is supposed to be against the clans, man. Why do they got such crappy mechs? We better get good salvage out of this. Alright, let's go tear these guys a new one. I was going to wait for them, but there's no point. Let's clean this up, guys. Ready for orders. Yeah, we'll wait. 
4.3%. I think we'll wait. Where are you going? You're going to make me chase you. Actually, pretty good chance to hit, fire everything. Ah, he took the PPCs. Good job, buddy. We got 12 Thunderbolts left, let's just use one, firing. You never know, you might get lucky, right? Eh. That's a miss. It sure was. I'd have been very shocked if it was a hit. Wow. Come on, you guys. Well, he's trying to flank. Receiving you. Give him an E for effort. Let's get over here. Going full throttle. This is the guy that's been hit already. Been hit on the other side, though. Let's blast this Arbiter. Yeah, firing. Really? That's not a line of sight? Oh, I guess not. I'm coming to get him. I'm not going to bother waiting. This is just painful now. What's up, boss? Double time. Let's go. How are you even going to shoot, huh? This guy. Come on. Nice. That's what you get for trying to flank. feasible a lance of four melee mechs would be. Commander. Like if we've tricked out the, uh, the Nodachi, the Victor, and the Mjolnir. That's three half-decent melee mechs right there. Could technically run the Wolverine or something like that as well. Yeah, I mean, or even the Orion, right? Go with just four melee guys. Big engines, just rush in and smash people. I'm here. All right. I don't think we're going to be uh, killed by these guys here. Orders. While we're standing on there, but we'll see. All right, firing. Mm-hmm. 
Thanks for coming out, buddy. Light damage, Commander. All right, who do we finish up here? Ah, uh, that guy's not going anywhere. He's got no weapons. Let's just blast this guy. He's going down! He's going down! Mm-hmm. Come on, buddy. Give us a melee attack. Sure, that works, too. And that Jager mech's not even going to get into battle before these guys are dead, I don't think. Come on, buddy. Wow. Uh, we can't multi-target those two other guys. I was hoping I was going to be able to target both Bessies, but... I can't. I'm just going to target this one. That's yeah, cool off. Blast this guy firing. Ah, yeah, man, the trees are in the way. Hey, welcome to the fight, finally. Yeah. Commander? Copy that, Commander. See if we can overheat this guy. Better chances to hit. Firing. Okay. Yes, Commander. Let's do this. And let's do this. Might as well remove some of our heat now. Fire on that guy. Eh. Meh. Receiving you. Acknowledged. Let's shoot this guy. It's taking forever to kill these guys. Of course, right after I say that. Wow, that's kind of a bad positioning. Does that guy just not have ranged weapons? I'm receiving you. Move order received. That hit something good. Alright, see what they do here. Thanks for coming out, buddy. Thanks, you know, give him an A for showing up. Standing by. Give him a D for maneuvering. Wow. Target neutralized. Standing by. On my way. Sure. Let's do this. Firing all weapons. Hostile eliminated. Feels kind of uh, dirty killing them that way, but whatever. Whatever it takes. Good 
Goodbye. There it is, folks. Let's go home. All right, 242,000. That should more than cover our repair cost. Don't think we took any penetrations at all. Nah, I think we're pretty clean here. Okay, let's have a look what we can get here. So the Wolfhound Grinner, the Wolfhound Max. That makes interesting sense. Spider Spect or sorry, Specters. So we got some clan stuff here. ER clan larges. 40 heat, eh? ER clan medium for 20 heat, 33 damage. What else do we got? Clan heavy machine guns, clan light machine guns. This is a possibility. Uh, medium heavy laser. I think that's probably one thing we should take. Clan medium pulses are okay. Um, C3 Slave, I think we have enough of these now. Should we take it though? Let's drop it in just in case. Clan Cockpit, Breaching Shot, Increase Sensor and Sight Range, plus two initiative. initiative. Mm, ECMs, Clan Endos, nice. Enhanced Imaging. Yeah, man. Can't not say no to that. Plus 10% weapon damage dealt. Plus four initiative, minus 15% reduced reduce damage taken. Oh yeah. Um, defense gyros, these are always nice. Don't have any available right now. Clan double heat sinks, clan double heat sink kits. Patchwork materials. Um, retractable blade. T what's this? TTS weapons C, plus two accuracy to what? With ranged weapons? Are you kidding me? Oh yeah. Upper ballistic. That's something we were... Oh no, we've got one of these now on the... Uh, on the Victor. Hmm. Patchwork materials tier 3 are nice too. Ah, man. As much as I want to take the clan weapon, I think I should probably leave it out and go for other stuff. Clan endosteel for space is always nice. These clan cockpits aren't bad. ER large laser is 40 heat. But you know what? Let's drop this and grab one of the ER larges. See if we got another one. Let's confirm this. So Bessie part, hooray. Uh, two Grinner parts, two Jenners, one Spectre. Clan Flamer, Clan Medium Pulse, nice. Clan Cockpit, uh, Clan Guardian ECM, which is lighter. Uh, Clan Double Heat Sink, which is nice. A regular Heat Sink Kit Clan. Yeah, that's actually pretty good. So let's confirm this. All right, um, 31,000, not bad. So we should make our financial report. Yep. Let's take one more mission here. See if we can find a low-end clan mission here. We can get some more clan gear. Uh, hide the evidence. A worldly on black site. Coupe. Local pirates. There's nothing really low. We should do challenge with our lance. This is the wrong lance to fight be fighting this with. So let's take um, against the Outward Alliance, three skull. Battle in the Highlands. Destroy an Outward Lance. We should do that. Just go ahead and do that. Three skull. Well, let's 
Let's destroy this base instead. This will be faster. Uh, let's go right down the middle. Accept this. And let's bring in our secondary lance. Uh, Squire's coming in. Uh, tugboat. And uh, we've got Jazz and Kerberos. So let's run the Nodachi down here. And so the, this Catapult 1A, that's the missile launching one. Here's the other one. You guys haven't seen this in action yet, so let's bring that out. Uh, and then let's bring in this one. Let's run this and get it done. Yeah, we're in a restricted zone. Why aren't we in a restricted zone? Time to get dirty. Okay, Jazzy Jeff, let's get up here. So this uh, particular um, um, catapult's got a uh, bonus PPC and a couple of MML nines. It's not a bad direct fire loadout. And this other catapult, you know. The two fifteens and the two uh, fives, which isn't too bad for fighting inner sphere guys. But we're gonna want to pick up some clan LRMs. Yes, Look at the speed on this thing. Doing a little disco dance there. Disco shuffle. Um, I don't know. What's up with you? Affirmative. Let's get this done fast. Locust, light missile carrier, centurion, goblin, eh? Okay. Alright, firing on this guy. Copy that. Yeah, thanks for coming out. What's up, boss? Alright, Tugs, get in here. Yeah, still a little laggy here, guys. But I think that's fixed in uh, 998. Engage. We're still in 997 here. Can't upgrade. Chugga, chugga, chugga. Come on, man. We want to finish this off fast. Okay. Right here. You know what? I got a question for those of you guys that have operated the Nodachi, and I don't know if I'll get a chance this match, but right can you use that uh, sword on um, stationary targets like you can with a wrecking ball and stuff? For an it's a good question. Because once again, it makes it, if you can't use the sword, on, you know, anything that's standing next to you, that makes it pretty much useless. Yes, come in. Because, you know, you get the guys with the spike wrecking balls and they're just gonna, like, Understood. stand next to something and destroy it. Be better to use those. Alright, firing on this guy. I'm gonna give him the I hope we can salvage that. I don't. Let's see if this is one of those old crappy Centurions. Oh, he's backing up. <laughs> I don't blame you, buddy. Nobody will complain if you go home. Alright, MML turret. Well, we won't complain. I'm sure they will. Commander. Let's get some eyes on for us, please. ECM jamming. That's uh, really bad chance to hit. A little better on this guy. Yeah, it's the old version. This guy's got eh, it's kind of chunky armor. Let's just fire on this guy. Roger that. Nice. The peeps hit anyway.
Ow. System holding. Right in the nipple. Yeah. Yeah? Alright. Um. Come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Need to get home before dinner. Uh, yeah. This guy could be hazardous. What's up, Commander? What's up, Commander? You're the commander on this one. Full speed, no shoot. Got it. If you weren't Yang's friend, man, you would not be here. Jesus Christ, dude. Alright, fire in three. Receiving you. Steve's abilities make all the difference. That minus 5% heat makes a big difference with four PPCs, that's for sure. Alright, jump everything into this guy. Well, at least he has a harder time hitting with that heavy rifle. Six million dollar centurion. Alright, we'll find out in two turns if we can actually use that sword against the building. Ow! Stop! You're ruining the shiny neon paint. He's interesting, you he's making you interested in melting armor. Sorry guys, I'm just really tired right now. <laughs> ah, it's the middle of the night. Um, I said I was going to be there in two turns, I'm not going to be. Well, maybe. Get that close to it. Bing! Vigilance. Firing on this guy. Taking the shot. Still going, eh? Hey, he's moving. <sighs> Should be able to pull the centurion down this turn. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't look like it will be. This guy. Everything. Firing. In all there we go. Target eliminated. Man, I'm loving those Ready four PPCs. If we can get the Orion running exactly the same way as that guy, we're going to do really well against the clans, that's for sure. Alright, we want to shoot... Well, let's kill this turret. I was going to say we're going to wait, leave it for the melee attack, but I think the sooner we can get rid of these guys, the better. Yeah, Commander. Same thing, please. Understood. We can vehicle squash. Next turn. Let's just make sure this guy's gone. Firing. Nicely done. One less turret. Yep. SPL. Oh, I'm wounded. Of course. Yes, Commander. Christ, you're wounded minus six initiative next turn and you're still going before everybody. <laughs> the hell? Okay, I can't fi figure out if we can get next to one of these guys. Uh, let's go.
here. Minimize, minimize the direct fire against us and let's just shoot on this turret. Okay, good start. Okay, Tugs, finish that turret off, please. Position confirmed. Firing. That turret is gone. It sure is. Waiting for order. Okay, vehicle, please. Yeah, definitely underpowered. That's in, that uh, catapult. Those MMLs in there. I mean, we could load it down with MRMs and just hope that the massive uh, laser fire works out in our favor, but... Okay, they gotta indirect. Comes another one. Don't know how that's direct fire since it said it was indirect for me, but whatever. I can do. Yeah, kill that far turret. Moving out. No, you're busting out. All weapons are okay, you kill the far turret. Okay. Turret destroyed. Good to go. You yeah, always good to go. Okay. Full speed it is. 150, 150, 150. Let's go this route, see if we can put the damage a little bit on each one. Yeah. I suppose that's the myth. Standing by. Okay, let's get right next to this turret. I guess this is as close we can get. Acknowledged. C. No, I guess it. Can, I guess it doesn't work that way. That's you know, it's too bad. Affirmative. I guess I should have realized that since it didn't really show up. That turret is gone. <laughs> Who wants some of this, huh? Structure down. It's history. And another target. Ready for orders. Uh why can't you see that third building? That's just wrong. Yeah, what can I do you for? Okay, they're not being able to target these buildings. Receiving you. Location confirmed. Something is severely wrong with that. Locking on. Negative damage. What's up, Commander? It's all yours, buddy. Finish that up. Here you go. It's all right. We're leaving here hot. Hey there. Mission successful. All right. Payment increased by twenty percent. Not bad. And we didn't take any real damage at all. Yeah, we're good. Pick up a couple components here. Hmm. See, these, they changed this now. Weapon has a 30% chance to be damaged or explode after firing. Do you really want to have these things on you? Like, I don't even... It's almost like a waste now. Um, one shots. My god, there's nothing here. Incendiary ammo. Do we have incendiary ammo yet? I don't even know. No, we don't. 
let's take it because why not it's one thing you uni one unique thing we'll take internal combustion well got four light machine guns yeah you know what these things here we can sell this how much are these worth 322 well these are worth more so we'll take one of those all right let's see what we get Centurion locust part large laser and pretty much junk because everything was junk all right um yeah oh all right we got a locust we can sell that 20 grand at least we made some sea bills on that all right let's just go to the mech bay and sell that locust uh so that last mission was a perfect example of wow check this out of why i don't run those things on um um on camera anymore because they're just you know there's really no need to um just go after them for sea bills and that's about it right now um been running the main lance on those guys mostly just to get experience on them but you know we need to keep our uh, self afloat here we got a million sea bills per month um, two lances so we do run them as best as often as we can Kerberos is out for a bit so we got 10 days to the financial report I think we're probably okay let's manage our tasks a bit better here um, hmm. I think that's fine I think that's fine so we got five days before our uh, main lance is back yeah well yeah I think we'll use the Nodachi we're going to be taking a um, higher skull mission here. Let's take a look at the contracts on this planet uh, when our main guys come back. Pony Express, Ambush Convoy, Ghost Bear Convoy, three and a half. We'll probably take this next time. Um, yeah, probably take this mission next time and see how it goes. Sending a message is the same kind of idea. It's a destroyed base. Well, you know, this might be a little better. This is good for salvage. But fighting eight guys at once could be tricky but I, you know what we will do Pony Express next episode um, ambush up ambush us up a convoy and see what we can get out of it um, need a little bit more clan gear we need some money in the bank too just to be able to switch our mechs around I think the Nodachi um, I think if we lower the engine a little bit uh, either that or leave the engine and take the mask system out re-weaponize it a little bit with some clan weapons if we get some um, use it as like a mid-range close-range fighter and then trick up another melee mech somewhere we'll have to figure out how that's going to go I'm not sure yet um, the Axeman could be the same issue it might even be better just to drop him out of service but we'll figure that out another time I'm too tired to do that right now so I'm going, to end the, I'm going to end the episode here. If you guys liked it, drop a like. Add some comments in the comment section down below. I know a few people have been saying you should be running the uh, either the um, Victor or the uh, Mjolnir as the Mjolnir mech, which is you know probably a good idea. Um, the Mjolnir itself has been running really well with those four PPCs, and I'm thinking the Orion could probably do the same. So maybe we do the maybe we do do that is take the Victor and make it a Mjolnir mech. Although I looked at it, the problem is, too, is that Victor, the one arm, the right arm, uh, only has the upper joint, so you can't put any kind, of, any kind of melee weapons in the arm, which makes it kind of lousy. And the same thing happens with the Orion, I think. So that we really don't have much choice here, uh, heavy mech-wise. So maybe we go searching for some more heavy mechs and see what else we can get clan-wise to turn into a melee, melee bot. Right now, just leave the uh, Nodachi as it is. Maybe we take out that heavy, the uh, ERPPC or something, and I don't know, maybe put a couple of large pulse lasers in the arm, clan pulse lasers or something, and or those MRM 20s in the torsos, or I don't know, we'll figure it out. All right, guys, so that's it. We're going to end the episode here, and um, yeah, until next time, we'll see you later.